we had something happen at our church. I was at a meeting at church, and uh, my wife has always told me, uh, don't leave the keys in the ignition of the car. But when the meeting was done, I couldn't find my keys. I checked everywhere, under the table. I checked at the reception desk, no keys. No keys anywhere. And then I remembered, I bet you I left them in the ignition. Because this is a smart thing to do. If they're in the ignition, you don't have to find them in some crack. You find the car, whoo, there's the keys. <laughs> but my wife, Diane, has told me, do not leave the keys in the car. She said, someone is going to steal your car. Don't do it. <laughs> well, I knew she was going to be upset. I went out to get the car. It was gone. It should have been right outside the door. It was gone. I called the police. I told them the church I was at. I said, someone has stolen my car. And then I made the most important call of all. I called my wife, Diane. And when she answered the phone, I said, sweet baby, I have disobeyed you. <laughs> I left the keys in the ignition of the car. My car has been stolen. Nothing, just silence. I said, sweet baby, are you there? Nothing. I thought AT&T had dropped a call. I said, baby, are you there? She said, Ken, I dropped you off at church. I said, come and get me. And she said, I will, as soon as I convince this policeman I have not stolen your car. 